Hey everyone, um, <clears throat> welcome to this conversation. Um, today we're talking about um, John Winthrop and his City of Women article. And this is an article that was written by um, Laurel Thatcher Ulrich. Um, and it, it is a very interesting article. I was um, sort of reading what other people have, have said about this article as well as um, other articles that went along with it. And uh, to be sure, John Winthrop was a very complicated person. Um, some of the things that I thought, um, as a Puritan, he definitely wanted to uphold Christian principles. And I mean, even today, Christian principles and women's role in 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 church is just kind of complicated. It's never not been complicated. And I believe that when you um, incorporate this with his city on a hill um, sermon, you get a picture of John Winthrop, who um, was just someone who wanted to make sure that what other people were seeing was a solid, biblically Christian example. Um, I do think that his pride got in the way in, in, in a lot of ways. Um, he definitely disliked women. He did not like for women to be, um, to, to have a voice, but he also recognized that they had a place in society. And I think that in sort of the most famous of the examples was his treatment of Anne Hutchinson, um, who was a very gifted teacher and a gifted speaker. And, um, you know, people listened to her. Um, and I, I'm, I'm not confident enough to say that um, he didn't think that she was gifted. But I also don't think that he thought she should be the one talking about um, what she believed from the Bible or how she interpreted things like that. So, of course, he had her banished from Massachusetts, which is crazy, but it's something that happened. Um, you know, one of the things that he probably feared was religious dissent was people saying, this is not what religion looks like. This is not what Christianity looks like. Um, so he's a complicated guy. Um, in doing this article, I also used um, Emerson and Morgan's The Puritan Dilemma, which gives, which gives some more um, sort of context to to where he was coming from as a Puritan man and leader. Um, I also used Myers, um, the social studies, which sort of talks about in in Hutchinson and her historical um, part of the story. And of course, I used this article, Ulrich's um, John Winthrop City of Women from the Massachusetts Historical Review. Um, I think that, I think he was complicated. I think that no one is perfect and he definitely was not. Um, but I think he probably had a lot going on up in his head about how do we create an environment that everybody's looking at that is going to reflect our biblical principles. Um, so I hope that you have learned something and I'll talk to you later.